Hello everyone, welcome to my bulking mistakes video. If you watched my previous video from me transforming, sort of putting weight on, um, I mentioned that I made some mistakes and I wanted to go over it in a video. So that is this video. Uh, I want to keep this a little bit shorter because I can ramble. So let's talk about the mistakes I made. So number one, food. I tracked everything through the week, um, 2,800 calories, and I did do it at the weekends for a bit, and then I stopped doing it at the weekends, and some days in the week, I would track through the day while I was at work, and then I wouldn't in the evening, so I don't know what meal I had. Therefore, my calories went up, um, without me knowing about it, maybe to 3,000, you know, because your body doesn't go day by day, it goes by week or by month, so... Anyway, the calories went up and I put on weight a bit too fast at the start. Um, I did rein that in, but it's a mistake that I did make. So there was my mistake with my food. Second mistake is um, goals. Now, I said in my other video when I started this, the bulking video, that the goals were very, very important to get you know bigger and stronger and faster. Now, I didn't. Uh, I worked around my one rep maxes, uh, that was my squat, my deadlift, and my bench. But I worked shoulders as well, so I didn't do an overhead press, which is where you stand with the bar, you know, you don't move your legs, you keep them straight, and you push above your head. Now, I should have done a one rep max for that, because how am I supposed to gauge how much stronger I got on my shoulders without that movement? So that is a mistake that I made. Another goal that I should have made is with my cardio. I said I wanted to get faster. How do I know that I got faster? I didn't track a 5k run at the start and at the end. You know, I didn't have anything to progress with. All I did was do the same cardio and saw that my uh, cardiovascular, my heart rate went down. And that's about it. My, you know, I can do a bit more. So I have got better with my cardiovascular, so my heart rate as I do perform the same exercises but it's not good enough, I should have tracked like I did with my squats, like I did with my bench press, it's just as important and I made a mistake. So I will learn from next time. Another mistake that I made, and I think this might be the last one, is rest. Rest. Now, I'm not just talking about resting after the gym, um, you know, sitting down and not doing much. I'm talking about sleep. Now, I work shifts, um, I work a late and a early shift. Early shift is at 7 o'clock in the morning to about half 3 and late shift is half 2 till 11 o'clock at night. Now, I came, if I was getting up for an early shift, I need to set off about an hour, 45 minutes before 7 o'clock in the morning. And I do that, go to the gym after work, get home at half 6, 7 o'clock at night, so I've been out for 12 hours in the day, and then I would, you know, catch up on things, you know, see my friends or do activities, or whatever it was in the evening, and then I'd sit there in my room late at night and I'd watch some TV, and next thing I know, it's 11 o'clock, and then I try and get to sleep, you know, I'm looking at my phone, and turn my phone off, it gets to 12 o'clock, I'm up at half five in the morning, that's five and a half hours, or if I sleep a little bit later, that's six hours, six hours sleep. There's not enough time to rest. And what did that do to me? It made me ill. And I don't mean with my Crohn's. Um, I got colds. Uh, I got the flu. I had to be off from work. I had, uh, I had two weeks separately where I didn't train because I had the flu and I had colds and I had swollen throat and stuff like that because of rest. If I'd have rested and let my body catch up with itself, and recover, instead of exhausting it completely, I would have been okay. So those are the mistakes I made. So what's coming up in the next couple of videos, guys, because that's it, those, those are my only mistakes, and that's done. Uh, what's coming up is, I'm gonna do a cutting series, or um, a dieting uh, series. I've bulked up, and I've built muscle, um, and now it's to show that muscle off. So it's time to burn the fat off, it's time to do a bit more cardio and show that underneath all of this fat, because I think I'm around 30% body fat, is some really good lean muscle mass. 
Uh, Christine Guzman is doing a, um, a competition where you show yourself now and then you show yourself in 90 days. And I'm going to be doing that competition. I've just applied uh, by sending off of, uh, my physique. I will show my physique in my next video on my like week one of uh, my cut. I don't know what I want to name it. If you have an idea of to name it, write down in the comment section. I know most people aren't very interactive uh, on my videos because a lot of you come from uh, Facebook and you don't really use YouTube very often. But I appreciate everyone who watches my videos and I hope you learn something. So those, my mistakes, that's what's coming up. If you got to this part, like the video, it does help. Comment with any suggestions. Thank you for watching and see me in the next video when I talk about my diet. Bye.